I can tell you, they are super dark, as y'all can see. I'm sure once this white shows, it's gonna be even darker. What's up, everybody? It's your boy Q. You know who. Back! Another video. Thank y'all for coming kicking with me. Now you gotta say what's up. What's up, y'all? <laughs> boy at. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Check Shout boy out. Boy off the script. Spell it. because I'm O F F D A S C R P T. Check no underscore? Is it no. straight? Hey, yeah, my bad. O F F dash D A. Yeah. Script. You gotta get an Instagram page for it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, you gotta get an Instagram page. That way you can say follow Instagram and then link your YouTube. Oh, yeah. Yeah, right. so yeah, it's just easier. I'm over here now. Y'all know I had an issue with the tail lights. I ordered some offline that didn't work, and I noticed on that video that my other tail lights that I, I spray tinted before, the tint kind of faded on. They're not as dark as they used to be. So I'm actually about to reapply that tint. And what I did with mine, guys, I painted tape the clear parts with this right here. And I'm just gonna have the red dark, and that's gonna leave this white. So some people spray tint the whole light. I personally don't like that because this is my re my real lights. I don't want my reverse light darks where I can't see. Got the my bad. I take people in the house. Yeah. All right. Y'all, yeah, he live in yards, so y'all. But anyway, so I got the tent over here warming up. Um, this is the bottle I used last time as well. So I just got it warming up, heating up really quick to kind of, you know, I don't know. That was a vibe just to heat it up. So I got it heating up. And so now I'm going to go ahead and tape off my um, lights here really quick. Um, with the, tape off the white part. And then just make sure, too, when you're taping it off. Last time I learned my lesson. I didn't tape it 100% accurately. You can see, like right there, it kind of went, it didn't, you know, it didn't take, it didn't paint that because I didn't tape it right. I take this out pretty good, actually. But anyway, I'm probably gonna do like two or three coats, get them pretty dark. I'll talk about that in a second. All right, guys, so yeah, my box, ideally, you want to do this inside because there's a lot of debris in the air. You know what I'm saying? So you don't want those speckles like on your light, but I did it outside last time, no big deal. Last time I think I hit it with like three or four coats. Like, hold on, what's a coat? Is down and up one coat? Or just down one coat, up one coat? Uh, I'm not sure. I don't know how they do that. Like, what is a coat? Like, just is down and up one, or is down one? Up is two, down is three, up is four. I don't know. I, I don't know how a coat works. I probably should Google that shit. Up and, up and down. You think up and down is one, probably, yeah, huh? Yeah. That's what I was thinking too. Yeah. I always think for full coverage. Right. So up and down. I, I thought up and down was like one coat. So I might do it a little darker this time, like three or four coats. Last time I did it, it did look good, but it just faded away a little bit. So go a little darker. Ideally, too, you want to do this when it's warm outside. I don't know if y'all can hear me. You want to do this when it's warm outside, but it's cold. It's December in Texas, so it ain't warm. So it ain't gonna be warm. So that's all good. All right, guys. Here we go. You're gonna to wanna to start on the edge and then spray. Oh man, I ran out. All right, so that's one coat. I'm gonna do two for sure, I might do three. Start on the outside and then work that way because you know, when you first start spraying, you get like blotches, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, just keep that in mind. If I did another video of this, I'm gonna link it below. You can go watch the full process, there's a little more detail. I didn't feel like going way, way in detail since I already did this before. But yeah, I'm gonna finish up and show y'all the finished product and tell y'all how many coats I decided to do. All right guys, so that is, I went three coats. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six. So basically six six times up and back but if you count them two together that's three colors but look see how i said y'all need to cover it and don't do it outside like it has like specks in it you know what i'm saying like specks from like the dust and all that stuff in the air so if you can cover it but i'm waiting to dry you gotta wait like you have to wait like 30 minutes to let it dry before you can touch it but yeah definitely cover it if you can because you're gonna get like the specks just from stuff in the air falling down on it so just q-tip Shit, I might go one more darker. Nah, nah, nah. Okay, guys, so it's probably been about a whole day since y'all saw the last video when I painted my tail lights. Like I tell you, they are super dark, as y'all can see, and I hasn't even taken the tape off yet. So I'm about to go ahead and do that now. I just want to show you how dark they are, and I promise you, once this white shows, it's going to be even darker. It's going to look a lot darker. So let's go ahead and take this off. Yeah. Here we go. 
Oh, that's gonna look bad right there. Yeah, I figured that was gonna look bad. That's all I'm saying, guys. Make sure when you tape it, you tape accurately. Don't don't be like me and be semi lazy for sure. Let me go ahead and finish getting this off, and I'll show y'all the finished product. All right, guys. So that is the finished look. As you can see, I love the way it came out. That looks perfect. Yeah, that looks perfect. So I messed up really, really bad on this guy, guys. Like right, we got the light right there. I messed up here. I messed up. This just looks terrible down here. <laughs> oh, that looks bad. But anyway, I didn't think I didn't think I messed up that bad. But on the other side, I did pretty pretty good. So here's the other side. It looks a lot cleaner. I only have like one mess up, which was like right here on this strip right here. I got some in the white. But other than that, it came out pretty good. But from a distance, you can't tell unless you just get up. But this looks perfect. This looks really, really good. Like, I like the way how dark it came out. So, um, I went, what's that, three coats. I already said in the video, three coats, which is six total passes, I think, how y'all counted. So, that's what you're going to get. My only advice is, when you're doing this, of course, is to, one, make sure you're taping off your lines pretty accurate. Or you're going to get that. You're going to get some stuff like this where it's going to be not showing or it's going to show where you didn't spray Two, let it dry so i let mine sit for a whole day but that wasn't by choice i just got home late after i did them and i wasn't able to put them on at night but let them dry you want to wait a good 40 minutes maybe 30 40 minutes an hour an hour to be on the safe side because what's going to happen once you start touching here you're going to get like finger imprints on there last thing number three when you're spraying you saw i spray my video spraying here right shh, shh, shh. Just make sure you get in this back side here because you can tell this is a tad bit lighter than this here. Just a tad bit. You can't tell it's the light hit it like exactly right. I mean, otherwise it looks perfect. But I was trying to go back and hit on the side. So just make sure you're equally spraying when you're doing this that you're getting this side because this is round and then this is flat. So it's kind of hard to get that. I found some shade just to show y'all what they're going to look like at nighttime. Man, the truck looks good though. The tail like that completely changes it. It looks really, really good. So this is what you can expect at nighttime with the turn signal. As you can see, you clearly can still see it. It's not too dark at all. Uh, yeah, so you shouldn't have any issues with that being a problem. Let me step back if so y'all can see a little better. Yeah, you clearly can see them. So, but just for y'all who might be wondering how dark it looks and can you still see the bulbs, you can still see the bulbs very, very clear. I think this side is a little darker, maybe can't be certain, but it looks like this side is a tad bit darker than this side. But that's just me noticing it. But yeah, man, let me check y'all. Look at it, she looking good, bro. She looking good. We got a few more things coming, man. But yeah, I just want to show y'all that how it looks at night time. <laughs>